In this tutorial, you'll learn how to scrape large amounts of Flipkart product data with our free web scraper Parsa. Flipkart was founded in 2007 by former Amazon employees and is India's second largest e-commerce company right after Amazon India. In fact, Flipkart generates over 40% of India's e-commerce industry and sells a similar volume of electronic goods as Amazon in India. We also have a tutorial on scraping Amazon if you're interested in that as well. As of 2022, Walmart owns a 77% ownership in Flipkart, bringing the platform's valuation up to $37 billion. After this tutorial, you'll be able to scrape all sorts of products from Flipkart, from books to mobile phones. Let's begin scraping Flipkart. Step 1. Scraping Products Begin by opening the Parsup software on your PC, Mac, or Linux system. Click the New Project button and enter the Flipkart URL you wish to scrape. We will be scraping phone cases with this URL. Once the page loads, click the first product's name to extract it. Click the next product's name as well. Scroll to the next row and click the first product product's name there too, to fully extract all 40 products on the first page. Sometimes you need to click multiple products to train the algorithm. Rename this extraction on the left to product. Step 2. Scraping prices and ratings. Begin by clicking the plus button next to your product selection from before. Choose relative select in the drop down and click the first product's name. Move the arrow to the respective product's price and click the price. All 40 prices should now be extracted. Rename the selection to price on the left. Do another relative select on your product selection and this time click the second product's name. Move the arrow to its rating and click to close the arrow on its rating. Redo the clicks for the third product to train the algorithm. Rename the selection on the left to rating. Note, the reason why we did the relative select for the rating on the second product is because the first product is a sponsored ad that does not have a rating. Step 3. Pagination To scrape multiple pages or every single page, we need to use Parsup's pagination. Start by scrolling down the Flipkart page until you see the next page button. Click the plus button next to your page selection, not to be confused with the product selection, and choose select. Click the next page button to extract it. Rename the selection to pagination on the left, expand it, and delete the two extractions. Now click the plus button next to your pagination selection and choose click. This is a next page button, so choose yes on the pop-up. Finally, choose the additional amount of pages you wish to scrape. We chose two for our example to scrape three pages in total. Enter zero if you wish to scrape every single page. Step four, bypassing blocks. Before you begin scraping, you need to enable Parsup's IP rotation. Note that this is a paid feature of Parsup. To enable IP rotation, click the settings cog on the top left of Parsup. Choose settings to open up the settings menu. Tick the rotate IP addresses checkbox. Agree to the IP rotation pop-up. You're now ready to scrape without blocks. Step 5. Starting your scrape. To begin scraping on Parsup servers, click the green get data button on the left pane. You can test, run, or schedule your scrape. In our instance, we chose run to scrape our three pages of products a single time as specified in our pagination step. This is what our data export looked like. Need more help with e-commerce scraping or scraping a specific website? Feel free to contact our live support. Happy scraping!